Full of glare. What's the crack? <laughs> Overtraining really is a... It's got to do with your nervous system more so than your muscles, okay? If you lift three times a week on legs and three times a week on chest, if you lift every day on legs or every day on chest, you're not going to overtrain your muscles. Your muscles just adapt to stimulation. They adapt to the forces that are put through it and the nourishment that they get. Your nervous system, however, is a little bit different. So signs of overtraining would be, you know, um, you might have changes in hormone levels. You will have a decrement in performance, so you'll have reduced performance, and you'll have really you'll have a reduced desire to train. So you won't want to go training. You might have head colds, which would kind of be related to a reduced immune system, and muscle won't break down from overtraining and overstimulation. You might get an injury, which would be a, which would be different to classic overtraining. Your fastest way to overtrain would be to do a sets to failure. So one set to failure and do that every single day. Do it as heavy as you can, one set to failure. You're going to just burn out your nervous system. That grinding that you do, that will just burn out your nervous system. So the grinding being literally when you're just pushing out a last rep on a bench and you've got someone spotting you just a half an inch every time and you're grinding, grinding, grinding. Okay, so that's taking up a lot of nervous, uh, that's activating a lot of your nervous system and can lead to overtraining. In terms of overreaching then, which is in the same realm as overtraining, and that's something we're going to talk about in a different video, and that will come with periodization, changing up your program basically over time to allow you to go to a point where you're actually quite... Uh, you know, you've trained quite hard for a couple of weeks and you're you're sore in the gym and you might be a little bit tired, but then you get a rest week and all of a sudden you see a whole pile of gains then once you go back after that rest week because your body has been given a chance to, to overreach and then whilst it recovers, it adapts and it um, super compensates. If you liked the video, please do subscribe. Uh, Partiglach in abroad. August Bridge to Gebla.